Someone came and took my cocoa beans. Did you take my cocoa beans, Scott? Be honest. Okay, so Scott says he's been in Scotland all week. <laughs> a likely story. You really expect me to believe someone called Scott lives in Scotland? Nice try. <laughs>
Sure, they're fun to have, but I mean, what are they really doing for me? Nothing. Nothing. That's the answer. So I'm going to go see Marlon to get my favorite fishy quest on my way home. And then we're going to go and check on the gift that Stacy has apparently left me. I saw all of your comments saying that Stacy left me a gift and you promised me it wasn't a trap. Which sounds pretty suspicious, I think, if you ask me. But I'm going to take your word for it. And I'm going to believe that you guys would not lie to me and that it definitely is not a trap. So I'm going to open it without even checking for traps. And if I die, that's on you guys. Right, give me a quest, Marlon, mate. You help me, yes? I do help you, yes. Squid Lake have many fish also. Wait, did that say fish on Squid Lake 22 times? Fish 22 times on the Squid Lake Island. Well, I've already done that quest before, but I guess we're back cycling through the quests again. I wonder if the rewards will be different. So, slash home, and I think it's up here. There's a bunch of torches, so let's see if we can get around there. See what Stacy's left me, and hopefully it's really not a trap. I'm really curious as to what is over here in my volcano. Like, it really trails off in one direction, like over here, look. So I'm very confused. Is there something hidden underneath? Because I'd be curious to find out more about... Hello, sir. Thank you. All right, we're on our way up. We're almost there. We're almost there. Uh, right. Uh, heard you needed this from Stacy Plays. Well, if this makes the sound of sizzling, you guys are going to be in trouble. No. Pumpkin pie, pumpkin pie. Obs Whoa. 32 obsidian? What the heck? Stacy, and a free chest and sign. What on earth? What a kind gift. Okay, you know what? Maybe it's time to do this. I think it's time to make my first power move here. And I am going to F ally Tiger. Tiger were informed that you wish to be an allied faction. Okay. So hopefully when Stacy comes on, she will accept that. Because Stacy is the first person, I think really, to give me a significant gift. Therefore, I see no reason to war with her. Thank you, Stacy, for the kind gift. That does mean I did not need to buy Obsidian in the last episode. But I, I did already, but... I will find a use for this obsidian, and it shall be glorious. So we changed the way that the warps work now, and like you have to wait three seconds for it, and you can have like three different warps, and it's cool, but it's also very tedious, it taking so long, honestly. Uh, right, I need to find a way to plant my sugar cane because I really need paper. I don't think there's anyone at the shops that sells paper. Scott doesn't think there's any shops that sell paper either, and Scott's probably right. So let's take a... Oh, I can buy sugarcane from Bobby, though. That'll work. Thanks, Scott. All right. So we can buy some from uh, our pal bobby -o. He will give us a good deal on these. Because if he doesn't, I'll never sell him my wheat again. Ten each. Let's buy 64 for now. All right. So now we have 64 sugarcane. So we're just going to split it, split it again, and then make as much paper as we can. 64 pieces of paper. That's pretty solid. Which gets us 26 books which means now we need is wood i was gonna buy some of the wood blocks just for speed but then they're well expensive 15 dollars each are you blooming insane oh man heck inflation is unbelievable back in my day you could get one of those blocks for three dollars whilst we're down here we'll do a quick farm run as well make sure that this is uh still doing okay oh this is bountiful look at this all right a nice successful uh grab and grow Right, oh, it's nighttime again. So I did actually use my shulker box this time around because uh, I had no space at all. All right, so now we got a bunch of stuff. So let's do this, this, this. Oh, it is not gonna be good enough, I don't think. Uh-oh. Smallish beans joined the game. Oh no. That's not good for me. That is not good for me. I'll hit him with a hello. I'm hoping he hasn't seen my video from last night. That's my that's my hope here. Wait, will I be able to buy leather from the death shop? Will the death shop sell leather? Because that's from mob drops, right? Oh, is it only bad mob drops, though? Yeah. No leather, sadly. No leather. I'm excited for this to open. Whatever this is going to be. The elevator. Like, I wonder what's up there. I'm very, very curious. Is there a way for me to see? Oh, my goodness. It's Joel and Lizzie. They're both on. I've never felt so threatened in my whole life, honestly. <gasps> Whoa. Can I see through the window? It doesn't like there's anything up there yet. Maybe it's going to be added later. Hi, Lizzie. Why is she going to PvP? I'm scared of Lizzie, so... But her willingness to just run to PvP shows that she is not scared of me, which is the correct way to be. To... Where'd she go? 
I'm oh my god, I got scared by the squire guy. Oh Holy moly, that was not cool. Not cool, my man, not cool. Lizzie said there was a secret loot chest in her video in a secret forest. What? That sounds crazy. How how is she finding these things? That sounds like fun. Someone tell me the coordinates of that place. I w I would like to go. For now, I'm sorry, cows, but you have to go. I need your leather. All right, we're back. Let's collect my steaks and my pork chops because we have loads now. And uh, I also brought a bunch of new leather. Uh, I went to the flower kingdom. As you can see, I've now killed a whopping eight out of 25 of these uh, sheep. Uh, I will actually have to finish that one off camera at some point. It's just a very boring quest. Like, I I'm not having fun doing it. I also am not finding any sheep in the flower kingdom ever. So uh, that's great. But for now, we're going to make another set of books. But we are getting there. We're slowly getting there. What does this give us now? Ooh, level 20 enchantments. We're super close. We're super close. In the last episode of Kingdom Craft, we noticed a cheeky little chicken who was hiding up on our volcano. And I've got a, a feeling he might be a spy for one of the other factions. So, I'm coming with seed and a name tag to try and bribe him to work for me instead. That's my, that's my master plan. That's it right there. Now that is a big jump. Honestly, bigger than I want to try and make. So I'm going to use this dirt for now. Okay, we're fine. This is fine. Hello, chicken. Uh, um... Hello, sir. Right. I come to give you a gift of seed. If I give you this seed, do you promise to be a spy for me and only me, chicken? Is that the case? Do you promise? I'm going to take that as a yes. Here, have this. And now I give you this name. You are a spy. We finally have another ally in this ongoing battle. We have a spy. His job will be to watch everyone that comes into my area while I'm gone. And tell me all of their secrets and what happened. Keep it up, a spy. You're doing great. So, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode of Kingdom Craft. Hopefully, you have enjoyed it. If you have, give it a big old thumbs up. Um, today's royal subject is... Hani Sultan, who was the first comment I saw that let me know about Stacy's thing. Stacy left you a chest. It's not a trick. It's a truce. Check her video she left on your volcano. Okay, so thank you to Hani Sultan for telling me the truth and not getting me murdered. You are today's royal subject. If you want to be next episode's royal subject, then make sure to leave a comment in the comment section and leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you're new. I have been CPK, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.